Will the budget bring cheer for the salaried class? Well, the Justice Eastward Committee, which is supposed to look into the issue, is batting for some tax relief. Remember, the Justice Eastward Committee has already submitted its report and its recommendations to the government. Sapna joins us now with that exclusive story. Sapna, the report has already been submitted to the government uh, in the hope that the government will be able to act on those recommendations in the budget. So what can we expect? What are the highlights? Well, clearly the issue panel has taken a very strong line in terms of supporting the salary taxpayers and here the strong recommendation that has come in and a very large part of the report in fact uh, deals with giving relief to salary taxpayers. It says very clearly that the government should adopt the, sal the standard reduction uh, part uh, in the, in, probably in the coming budget, as early as the coming budget. Standard reduction should be revived by the government to give relief to the taxpayers. That's a clear-cut message coming from the ESO panel. Uh, the other aspect that it also talks about is that there are lots of smaller reductions, uh, smaller allowances which are available. For example, uh, tax benefit is available only up to 15,000 rupees as far as your medical bills are concerned. Uh, they seem to indicate that this is not really helping the common taxpayer, especially the small taxpayer. So probably the government should put all of these smaller reductions, smaller allowances together and scrap them and instead bring in standard reduction, which will be a much more, which will be a much heavier relief in terms of uh, uh, the tax incidence. They are also indicating that this is not going to really hurt your current exemption limit, which is uh, around two, uh, two lakh crores, uh, two, uh, two lakh rupees at the moment. And uh, this should also not really affect your other savings basket like the ATC basket. There, of course, RBI has recommended very strongly that that should also be expanded. So these are the two aspects that they're talking about. Also, they're talking about other smaller issues probably but very important for the common man for example the notional taxability in terms of an unoccupied house property mm. so anything that you have beyond uh, of uh, self-occupied property a second house which may not be occupied but the rent the rental income is deemed to be so there is no tax uh, uh, relief available on that front. So there also they have said it should be completely scrapped. It's not really in sync uh, with, with the current policy of tax reforms. The third aspect, and this is again a very major part of the recommendations, uh, how do you reduce litigation for global investors? Uh, also bring about further changes, further tweaking in the transfer policy laws. This is again a third uh, critical takeaway from the issue panel recommendations. All eyes on February 1 budget, probably some relief at least for the taxpayers, salary taxpayers at least on the cards.